Janine, who was playing up the ground, uh, kicked goal. So he was responsible for two goals. Ball, the young full forward Cummings, and gave him two gimmies. But now I want to comment on this. Now look, Gary Lyon, tremendous use of the body. There is no free kick in that. That is a man-on-man -man contest, and the ball was handed to Gary Lyon 10 metres out. That should never have been a free kick against young Manton. And not long after that, the same incident, terrific play by the captain here. Look at that. That is class personified, but no free kick. And, and we got the chance to see Gary Lyon use his great ground skills. Tremendous. And uh, here's Andrew Obst, who came back into the Melbourne side. He's a tough, hard player. Now, have a look at this for a goal to Andy Lovett coming around the members' wing. Has a bounce, and this is where they kicked some great goals at the MCG. As Andy Lovell, one of those terrific midfielders, banging it through for a good goal. And you can see David Swartz very, very happy. And mentioning David Swartz, well, the votes I gave, well, I'll start from the bottom. Steve Phoebe, tremendous performance, about 35 possessions on a half-back flank. Gary Lyon took over at full forward, came up the ground on many occasions, just took over the game on the forward line with his class. David Swartz, enormous game at uh, centre half forward. He took about 14 or 15 marks and contested absolutely every issue. Yeah, Peter, uh, Matthew Phoebe started on the wing on Rick Olerenshaw. Sheedy had Olerenshaw off in the first four minutes of the game. I think uh, he had kicked two goals he on yeah. uh, Olerenshaw and he then had. he dragged him. Was that I too could, quick? Do you think I, that's too quick? I think it is far too quick. And I, I thought that uh, some of those Essendon blokes didn't know whether they were coming or going. I couldn't keep up with the changes. They were on and off the ground. They were at full back and full forward.